Hi guys, Charles on Reactions, and this video I'm going to react to episode 5 of season 2 of Doctor Who. If you watch this on YouTube, I also offer full reactions and early access on my Patreon. Alright, let's get into it. I hardly think working is the correct word. Sorry, I should say it's alive. What the Frankenstein is this? And a body that will never age or die. I don't think I want to see it. I, I think I pretty much don't want to see anything do you know ever. <laughs> nah, you're gonna get fall. killed by this new life. And how will you do that from beyond the grave? There you go. Kill him. You're dead. <laughs> Quite some touch, eh? Rise of the Cybermen. Oh god, here we go. What are you doing that for? Because you told me to. When was that? About half an hour ago. Oh! 29? 29? No, no, no. I'm He's literally standing there. <laughs> you forgot I'm about him. I'm just... No, I know exactly what I'm doing. You might want to take that back. I thought the quest would be worse. Not, not that this isn't bad. Dead. Wait, what? The TARDIS is dead. No! We're in some sort of known place. A silent realm. A lost dimension. Otherwise known as London. <laughs> What? Okay, so it's London with a big international Zeppelin festival. <laughs> but if the date is the same, it's parallel, right? I'm alright, I'm right, aren't I? Must be. What? A parallel world with Zeppelins. Parallel world, and my dad's still alive. Oh my god. Don't look at it, Rose. Don't even think about oh it. This god. is not your world. Trust me on this. Wait, what, what is it up in his ears? Don't tell me he's the cyber. What if he's the cyberman? Don't deny it's got your fingers. Wait, you also have those I'm confused. What? Oh, I can trust you, alright. Trust you to cock it up. What have I done now? Have a look. Jesus, they're loaded. Is it gonna be if our rose, but like this? Like, same age as our rose? And if you're giving out presents, where's my Zeppelin? Everyone else has got one. Rose! Why does everyone want a Zeppelin? Oh, she needs a good bath before tonight. She's gonna be honking. Rose! What? <laughs> My plans have advanced, Peter. The president has promised a decision. I'm flying in now. We'll be at the airstrip by five o'clock. Activate. Activate what? <gasps> Download. Tyler residence. What the hell? The first. What? Give me security arrangements. Yeah, headsets are superior. Parallel world is like a gingerbread house. Those temptations calling up. Oh, so it's just Rose then. Nothing out there to tempt me. Well, I don't know. I can't worry about everything. You just get this thing done. Mr. Lumic, the inventor of high content metal, has denied allegations of ill health. We're all flesh and blood, but the brain is what makes us human. TARDIS draws its power from the universe, but it's the wrong universe. It's like diesel in a petrol engine. But I've seen it in comics. People are hopping from one alternative world to another. It's easy. You've seen it in comics, you said it yourself. It's a light. Is it? Is that a light? It is a light! That's a light. That's all we need. We've got power! Ricky, we've got power! All you can eat free of charge. Don't just stand what a there. Horrible trap. Fill your faces Jesus. with tasty and lion. Feast yourself, brother. Feast yourself. What a feast! Okay, guys, I had a up to the national grid. Wrong sort of energy. It's gotta come from my universe. But we don't have anything. There's me. <laughs> I just gave away 10 years of my life. Worth every second. What the fuck, man? Just for doing that? You ready to take us home in 24 hours? 24 hours, so I have to make so sure that we don't die? Hours on a parallel world. Surely, don't become their daughter. That's not the way it works, Mickey Teller. 24 hours, yeah? Where are you going? Well, I can do what I want. I've got the address and everything. What are you gonna do? It's always about Rose. I'm just a spare part. Oof. I'm sorry, I I've got to go. Whoa, stop. Go on, then. There's no choice, is there? He's very sharp, I'd say. Sharp as ever. Hmm. Very clever man. Brilliant, in fact. Then you don't think he's insane? <laughs> That's not the word I would have used, no. You don't want to step on the thing. It doesn't look inviting at all. Where you been living, mate? Up there with the tops. I wish. 
so most rich people live in zeppelins? Nearly above others? If he's walked by his grand, she was such a great woman. God, she used to slap him. And then she, she died, she tripped and fell down the stairs. Daily Download, published by Cybus Industries. <laughs> oh wow, oh wow, oh no. Mr. Tyler is very well connected. It's nice, it's nice to getting some actual background on Mickey. Okay, hey, I'm Ricky. Of course I am, Ricky, that's me. You stupid Can we not slap people, please? Just hug! You? That carpet on the stairs, I told you to get it fixed. You're gonna fall and break your neck. Well, you get it um, fixed for me. I should have done way back. I guess I'm just kind of used to it. Uh, Don't get me. Oh! Huh? Oh, wait. What? Is a turn of you part of some kind of resistance? So that just leaves you. Leaves me what? The number one. The number one for? Top of the list. London's most wanted. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, cool. Say that again? Yeah. I don't need the pitch. I think we all know what this ultimate upgrade entails. It was needed for They're the exposition, the mate. The answer is no. And then you're gonna be dead. Dude, you already have the thing in your ears. You're already on the control. You're a fine businessman, John. But you're not God. Yeah, a lot of people forget that. I turn to the right. Back to the left. Are you having fun, Mr. Crane? Make you do the cha-cha slide. <laughs> Let's cover up that noise. How about we just don't do that shit? That are happening there. <laughs> Never mind. What are you doing there? Oh my god. What am I doing here? Oh my god. What am I doing there? <laughs> what are we doing here? What are we doing there? <laughs> Fuck. They've got each other. Mom's got my one. She's got you. Those two haven't. <laughs> yeah. Ew. Ew. Go on. Get to the cat. Start her up. They just want to recreate so the Wizard of Oz. Okay, it's all right. It's all right. It's all gonna be okay. Do you think he has some kind of like implants? But he doesn't just look like me. He is exactly the same. We are the preachers. The preachers. As in gospel truth. What? Target number one is Lumik, and we are going to bring him down. From your kitchen? <laughs> Have you got a problem with that? He's no, just observing. Kitchen. Looks like Gemini was right. Lumik's finally making him. Who the hell is Gemini? Is it like, right and pack up the, the like the Oracle? It's making me nervous how she's Still. holding those glasses. You should be. It's a great party. You can trust me. <laughs> you can trust me on this. Oh God. <laughs> Still too late. I moved out last month. I don't know, you just seem sort of. What? Familiar? What are they doing? Uh, are we gonna have the first go Luke or not? It's worth a second chance. Are you commenting on my marriage? Uh. No, I was just. Who saying. the hell do you think you are? You're staff. I don't know how many parallel worlds there are, but I wouldn't be surprised if. In not one of them, it works out for you. Her parents. Uh oh. The oh, do you have the honor scene first? I've seen them before. What are Hold they? on, weren't they? Were they part man. of the collection? <laughs> oh my God! Hence that thing. They, what? But seriously, weren't they part of the collection of that uh, of that American? We have been upgraded. Into what? The next level of mankind. We are human point two. Human Every point two will receive a free upgrade. Upgrading is compulsory. And if I refuse, then you die. You will be deleted. Ugh! 
Yeah, it won't take long before Windows will <laughs> try to pull off this shit. That's not your mom! Why would you run into the basement? Like, I want to laugh with the with how they look, but somehow I can't laugh. Like, I just, I just want them away from me. Well, I never see you again. Uh, Rose, that's... <laughs> that's not Mickey. Who are, but who the hell are you? Rose! You are incompatible. Oh. But this is a surrender. You will perish under maximum deletion. Maximum deletion? As if regular deletion isn't delete, deletion enough. Delete. That's the goddamn ending. The audacity once again. <laughs> well, uh, this was episode five of season two of Doctor Who. I thought it was pretty good. Um, I'm definitely. Very curious about the second part, though. I feel like the second part is going to be even better. Um, um, I like, you know, I would say I do like the, the premise. I do like the idea of exploring, like, parallel worlds and alternative worlds, whatever. I mean, it makes sense that we would have that. I'm surprised, you know, now that I think of it, that it didn't happen sooner. Mm, I was worried about the whole, you know, Rose once again having to deal with, oh, will I be able to... Not to defeat my parents, their lives, or, you know, at least in this case, it's not like she knows for sure if, you know, her parents are going to die and, and therefore she can't, I guess, directly intervene. But it still made me very nervous. I was still like, ooh, you know, last time we had that episode, was it was it Father's Day? I think I thought it was Father's Day, I'm not sure. Uh, I was a big, big mess. I don't want to be a mess again. Uh, but the focus wasn't that much on it. It was more... Uh, it was more, I guess, about... Hmm. But I don't know, so focus for me... Not that he wasn't the main focus, but I just felt like my attention was getting more towards Mickey for me personally. Uh, and I liked it. Like I said, I do appreciate me getting some more background, even though it was a very tragic one. That was um, quite hard to see how he noticed that the carpet, um, you know, is like damaged. And he knew that at least in his world, that's how he lost uh, his his grandma. That's how she ended up falling and eventually dying because of that. Well, eventually. Um, so that was, it was quite fast. I, I wished a little bit we had some more time, you know, with, with uh, Mickey and his grandma. Um, I like that. I, I think it, it, it went by a little bit too fast. Uh, although it was definitely shocking to see this fan uh, swoop in, snatch him off the streets, um, and then, you know, figuring out, or I guess being told that he's, you know, he's pretty much now the number one, like, wanted, uh, like, number one on the wanted list, and he seems to be part of some kind of resistance, and then, to a surprise, we actually have this Mickey vs. Ricky moment, um, because his alternative version doesn't even have, I mean, they're, pro well, uh, better, uh, oh god, I'm blanking out, talk English, talk English, um, they have pretty much the same names, but still, uh, but I really like that confrontation between the two of them, uh, especially, you know, Ricky's reaction, he was very much like, okay, what is this shit, <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, even though he did call him duplicate, he, he did take him with him for the ride, uh, and thank god that they went out, because we just saw, well, thank god, they did help them at first, but then things still kind of went to shit because, like the doctor said, bullets don't really do much against those cyber humans, I guess. Also, I it took me very long <laughs> to realize. I think I, they literally had to tell me that it was just earbuds. Like I at first when we saw uh, Rose, her father, I thought they were like metal. Like I didn't even think of earbuds or something. I just thought it was like. Something like in their brain and it kind of stuck out of their ears. Well, it wasn't really that, but it was still quite disturbing. We had this whole thing going on. But yeah, um, I didn't even think about earpods. <laughs> uh, but now it's definitely a little bit creepy. Uh, especially with the whole Apple earpods uh, going on these days. <laughs> even though I, I mean, know that we don't have robots like this walking around. Right? Hmm. But yeah, that was definitely very, uh, very concerning. But I like that we had this whole build up to seeing, I guess, those 
robots. Um, well, not robots. Cyberhumans? I'm not sure. Um, who I'm pretty sure like are also from the from classic Who. I'm pretty sure uh, because again, I do think that we seen at least their heads before um, in episode. Which episode was it? I don't know, I forgot the episode number. Well, anyways, in the season one episode with the American, like I said before, uh, I think that this, like, one of their heads was part of the collection. So I'm, I'm, I do think it was the same robot. And the doctor did say, like, it's happening again. Hmm. Uh, yeah, so that's also, you know, interesting not to the, to the, well, more than that, it's not just a not, but, like, interesting that they worked that in. Hmm. Also, you know, again, seeing that it seems once again that uh, uh, Wolf's parents just weren't meant to be, you know, even in this parallel world, things, you know, they were they were together for a long while, but now it's pretty clear that once again, and not on the, you know, best, best terms, uh, they're pretty much staying together because they're worried about what people w would think of them, not because, you know, they still want to be together with each other. Um, and which, again, is very hard to to see for Rose um, I was very nervous when she started when her father started talking with her I was scared that maybe she would say too much or he would realize something but though how will he even but still I mean the, the same thing happened with Father's Day he also was like okay what's going on here and he kind of figured it out um, but again it's the focus isn't really that much on it anymore. We're more worried about, oh, how about we don't all get to, you know, get transformed or processed into cyber humans. In this case, the doctor tried to uh, surrender. You know, he thought that would save their lives. But uh, I guess, you know, like the, 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 the cyber human said, they're inferior. They're not good enough, I guess. Uh, so I'm very curious how exactly that will be solved. I mean... I'm sure, so far, you know, when we end on the cliffhanger, when we have, I guess, a two-parter, uh, I'm pretty sure that we always immediately continued, so I'm guessing, you know, I'm gonna get that answer very soon. Uh, I'm just trying to predict, like, how is someone gonna step in? Yeah, maybe someone is gonna step in or do something, maybe the cyber humans are gonna be called back, or, like, ordered back, something. I don't know, I think it has to be, like, an exterior factor. Um... Also, oh, maybe this Gemini they were talking about. Maybe we're also going to learn more about uh, this Gemini. Maybe they will give us the solution or help us out. And then we also, you know, have we also have to deal with the whole 24-hour waiting period. I'm not sure how many hours are left. I wish they could just go to the TARDIS and disappear. But yeah, uh, it makes sense that they, you know, needed an excuse for them to stay here. Because, you know, this is like an alternative world, you know, it's... I can understand that maybe it would be more like, you know, it's another business, we're kind of out. Uh, but no, they don't really have a choice. Now it's more of a matter of, hey, can we survive here? Um, and that I haven't even talked about, you know, I've, I've pretty much been focusing on, on the creepy cyber humans. Um, but I haven't even really talked about this whole fact that with those ear pods, people, I guess, like, they all get the same information downloaded. It was so ugh, when they were all just standing still, and then when you saw that they were downloading a joke, they were all laughing at the same time for the same duration. Ooh. Mm. Yeah. I don't. Know, I'm just. I'm just pretty much curious towards the next uh, episode. To be honest, I kind of just want to know how it's all pretty much going to be resolved how we're gonna I don't know defeat these uh, cyber humans why do I have so much trouble saying that <laughs> uh, yeah I think those are the main things I think you know also something else I hope that uh, Mickey is also gonna realize that he's not worthless he's definitely not worthless not now um, I can understand why he feels that way um, so I'm definitely hoping that you know we will also get to see some uh, quote for him in that quote for him in that department yeah all right 
Thanks for watching. Bye.